Hello everyone, this is Helpful Beats, and today I just received a Bose S1 Pro. It is a battery powered PA system. So basically, this speaker goes up to, I believe, 150 or 60 watts. So it's supposedly very loud and uh, it's battery powered. So I don't need to plug into a wall when using this speaker. Um, now it's not a very large speaker, so I'm not gonna get the best bass performance out of this, but I really am looking just to amplify my voice to make myself louder for my beatboxing in which I'm going to be performing on the boardwalk. So, so yeah, let's get into this unboxing. I've got, uh, oh, I'm sorry, just got a text there. Okay, so got my trusty pocket knife here. It's already cut there. So yeah, I was pretty uh, looking forward to getting this and I wanted to show you guys what it's like. So this also comes with a battery, supposedly. About a year ago when this speaker came out, it uh, didn't come with the battery, which is pretty sad. People spent uh, so much just to, to have a battery powered speaker without the battery come with it is just a little funny. I've got some paperwork here. All right when you open up the box, power cord. Boom. And the speaker system itself. Alright, what else we got in here? Some more foam and a manual. So I sure hope the battery is inside the speaker already and not uh, non existent. But this speaker is also Bluetooth, so if I ever want to. Uh, play music from a phone which doesn't have a headphone jack anymore. I can always do that. Good easier there. Alright. So this is it. Battery looks like it's already installed. This is where the battery goes in, right at the bottom here. So, yeah, it's very nice, very nice feel. Good quality, that's for sure. But does it sound good? Is the question. You have three, three inputs here. So you got an XLR jack as well as a, a combo jack, so you can plug in uh, any other kind of audio equipment. Um, reverb, bass, treble um, for the first two inputs, and there's as well an auxiliary jack. So if you do have a phone or an iPad or any kind of audio system, you can plug in right into that audio jack and uh, play away. There's also Bluetooth and main volume controls for each of the three inputs. There's also a line out, so if you had another speaker, you could play to that speaker as well. Now, let's get this plugged in. This is a feature everybody's been showing off, but supposedly, yep, the logo rotates depending on which position you want to use it. And now the logo is upside down. There you go. You can put it upright, tilt it back and also put it on its side as a monitor. So let's see how this thing is. I mean, do a little test run. My video may cut off. I think it only runs for about 10 minutes until it stops on this resolution. But I have a microphone cord here.
Alright. Got our plugged in. I'm guessing. No, it's on. This is what we're all waiting for, right? What does it sound like? I mean, I'm not the most practical uh, tester of the speaker because this is, uh, I'm a beatboxer. So I know most people who buy a speaker aren't gonna be performing like this with a speaker like this. So uh, my needs are very uh, strict, I guess. I'm gonna plug into input one here. So far, everything's set to like completely flat. We got bass set level, treble set level, and the volume is at uh, fifty percent. No reverb. <coughs> That's good. That's good. I just had uh, an EKX uh, twelve inch. And I was thinking this this only has a uh, this has a six inch woofer inside, so I was I was expecting uh, a lot less because I'm going from a twelve inch to a six inch, and I'm thinking I'm going to have fifty percent less output, but sounds good. Okay, I'm gonna turn off the bass a little bit. Good. I mean, for a speaker this small, I mean, I'm talking small. This is this. Oh, by the way, this is this speaker is only like 15 and a half pounds, um, and it's battery powered. So this is like exactly what I've been looking for. Um, it hits off so many uh, little things I've been looking for in a speaker, like it's battery powered. I could use this as like a little uh, studio monitor almost. Put this up on my on a desk while I'm, you know, working through uh, videos or working on audio. So let's turn this, turn this bad boy up a little bit, eh? And turn up the bass. This is max, maximum bass. Um, treble usually goes up for beatboxing. Okay, and volume. This is, I, I'm not, if I start turning the speaker up too loud, I'm going to start the feedback, and I'm already getting a little bit of feedback, but not too much. Um, seems like they designed it just for beatboxing actually. The bass is really good for being just a 16, I mean just a 6 inch speaker. I'm very impressed. Supposedly it changes its EQ. It changes its EQ based on what position is 
fits in. It has like some kind of gyroscope in here. So if I tilt this back, it's supposed to change the sound. And I think I hear that it sounded uh, like mids got a little bit more pronounced. And if you tilt it like a monitor, it supposedly changes the sound as well. Sounds pretty nice. I'm really, I'm really impressed for the size of the speaker. Um, kind of disappointing that the, there is a, a backpack, which makes this like the ultimate busking street performing speaker. If you have a backpack that can fit this in here. I mean, I may be able to fit this in my own backpack, but we'll see that the backpack's $150. So you have to really be spending money. if You want to get the whole package there, but I'm impressed. And, uh, Thank you all for watching. This has been the Bose S1 Pro with healthful beats. So hope to see you guys in the next one. And I'll be street performing uh, hopefully, hopefully with this speaker, uh, either today or tomorrow on the Maryland Ocean City Boardwalk. So I'll see you guys there. I mean, I know nobody's gonna see me from this video. He's gonna be there, but yeah, anyways, see you guys. Bye.